Hey there guys, DG here, and I am going to show you, well, first off, I've been getting a couple of requests on how to, how, how I install mods, and I don't use any of the manager's things, I do it all myself, so I'm going to, going to give you guys a dorky way of how to install Minecraft mods, or the mods that I have, really, because, um, mods don't always, aren't always compatible, so you've got to get the right combination and I'm not real sure how to get the right combination so I'm just gonna show you guys how to install mine the ones that I have um, first off we want to get more creeps, creeps and weirdos can't talk today sorry um, you just hit this download button right here to get the latest version and it will it'll take you to this ad fly which I don't like but it just takes five seconds for you to be able to download it really you just right here and you can click this skip ad. Click download. That brought up another screen, which I'm going to exit that. Once that gets done downloading, I'm going to bring it to my my uh, desktop to just because it's easier to view. Also, we'll go back to more creeps. It says required mods. Now these are required to make that mod run. Mod loader and audio mod are pretty much well. Mod loader is like mandatory for most mods so we're gonna get those two which you just click the links it'll bring you to this web page right here gotta scroll all the way down I just I click the direct download because it, it's direct and you don't have to go through that ad fly oops sorry <laughs> that ad fly stuff and then audio mod is right below it just click the direct download and then got those two so we'll click that out and we've got we need to get this one so I'm gonna click this one and it's gonna take me to the ad fly thing which I do not like but oh well I will put up with it skip skip that it I do not want an ad which is not showing up oh well all right we'll cancel out that that tab now we want to go to more creeps and weirdos or not more creeps and weirdos, more creatures, my bad. <laughs> now well, this one is the one with all the kitties and the dolphins and the deer and the, the horses and all that. So you just want to click this right here, more creatures mod. It'll also take you to an ad fly. <sighs> Confirm your city. Woo, Groupon. <laughs> seconds to download. Now, we want to, oh wait, what other mods do we need? GUI.API, so right here where it says how to install more creatures, you just click the, uh, the show button where it says spoiler and click the GUI API and it'll bring you to this, which you want to scroll down, and it's right here, GUI.API, or GUI API, and then just click this right here. Yay, it seems like all the monitors today are using the ad fly. No, do not click that. <laughs> That'll probably give you a virus or something. Alright, got those two. For the more creatures. I believe it is. Yeah, because you just need mod loader, audio mod, and GUI, or GUI API. So we'll cancel that out. Now, more trees. This is on this page, and I'll link all of these links down in the, the description bar for you guys just to click to right away. But uh, you'll come to this right here, and I got them, it's right here, the more trees mod. You just gotta scroll down through all of these <laughs> all the way down to the bottom and right here see this one it says you need mod loader GUI API which we both are we have both of those already then this one right here tool tool utils we will download that right now you just gotta scroll down and it'll come bring you to this page you hit download another ad fly 
or Pizza Hut. <laughs> Eight medium. Eight dollar medium. Okay. This video is not endorsed by Pizza Hut in any way. <laughs> wow, that's a large potato. <laughs> Okay, let's scroll back up. <laughs> <clears throat> Alright. Oh, where'd it go? Where'd it go? Ah, there it is. Okay. Now we need to download the mod itself. Which, we hit this link right at the very bottom here. And we scroll down again. This is the long one. And hit the download gonna bring us to an ad play again, but it's alright. Tools. Oops. Okay. Now, these are our three main files that we're gonna be putting into our jar file. These are all things that... Oh, where did my GUI? There it is. Okay. These are all of the ones that we need to make these run. So, what we're going to do, we're going to cancel out this because we don't need it anymore. On your keyboard, you know the little Windows sign? I'm, I'm using a Windows, but I don't know how this works on a Mac, by the way. Um, hit the Windows sign, hold it down, and hit R. And it'll bring up your little run, run menu. And just put in the percent sign, and then app, A-P-P-D-A-T-A, -P -P and then another percent sign. And hit OK. That'll bring up your roaming uh, folder. You want to double click right here on your Minecraft dot Minecraft folder. And oh, first off, I need to go back and copy copy this. I'm going to just copy it to my desktop. This is I'm just backing it up because I don't want to um, delete it completely. <laughs> That's going to take a minute, and then I will completely get a whole new jar and all that good stuff. Whole new Minecraft. Thing. Alright, now I'm just going to delete this. You don't have to do this. Please don't do this because I need to get a whole other clean folder. And I'm just going to open up Minecraft again, hit the login button, and it's going to download a whole other .minecraft folder. Which is good. We need this. Once it gets done, you want to hit the exit, exit button. Go back to your roaming file, uh, folder, hit that, hit the uh, .minecraft folder, go to bin, and then right here, you go to Minecraft, go to open, WinRAR is what I use. I'm not really sure how to use this, use it with, um, what's the other one, Win7 or something like that, but um, you can get WinRAR, it's free, just go to www.win dash rar.com and it's completely free I promise <laughs> but this is super easy first off before you do anything you want to delete this file right here meta dash inf so we right click delete files yes that does nothing and won't let you load any of your um mods <laughs> sorry blinking okay now what we want to do this is our dot jar file, our jar file, Minecraft jar file. First off, we're gonna install all of the mods that are down here on the desktop, the uh, ones that we need that require to be loaded for the other ones. What I do, if it's not already a jar file or a um, a WinRAR file, and you can just right click it, open with, and then click on WinRAR our archiver. So I double clicked on the mod loader, we're going to shift and select all of these and just drag them into this file and hit OK. Now we'll go back to Tool, U tool Utils, <laughs> OK, and then right here you just want to double click on the bin folder and do the same exact thing, drag everything into that file. Done. Then we'll do audio mod. Same thing, you just click all of those, select all of them, sorry, you don't click on the file. And just uh, drag and drop. Achievement pages. 
Double click the bin folder, drag and drop. Now GUI API, you double or select all of this, drag and drop it all. Okay. All right. Now we have all of the requirements to load up all of those files, all of the mods that we're going to be using. Oh shoot, I forgot one. More stackables. You just want to go to that thing or website. Okay. Oh, it was in this file. I forgot to download it. <laughs> in this uh, web page. Just click right here, more stackables, and download direct. There we go. Now we will do the same exact thing. Drag and drop into the win or minecraft.jar file. Alright, now we have the bin file or the minecraft file dot minecraft file and then this over here is the minecraft.jar file. What we want to do is make this a little bit smaller so we can see things. Let's install the more trees mod real fast. You just want to do the exact same thing you did with everything else. Highlight, drag, and drop. Super easy. Into the minecraft.jar file. More creeps and weirdos. It's a little bit more complicated, but it's really simple. I'll show you how. I like to do this, but you don't. I, I don't think you have to. But this is how I've always done it. You um, double click on the more creeps and weirdos file, and it'll have this copy contents to Minecraft folder, which is right here with the bin and the resources and saves and all that. But I do that after I do this. You double click on it, click on double click on mods, double click on more creeps and weirdos, and drag all of these into your minecraft.jar file. Okay. Now, I like to drag these to the desktop because if they don't, they'll go into the file as um, zipped and I don't want that. <laughs> So we want to drag those to the desktop, um, click them and drag them into the .minecraft folder. Click um, do all for current items, then it'll just drag and drop. That's all you've got to do for that one. To um, adjust any of the spawns on the uh, any of the stuff, like know the friggin lawyers are annoying you just erase whatever number is there and put a zero that makes n that like lets none of them spawn 12 the number 12 by the name right here means a lot of them will spawn just so you know all right now we got more creeps and weirdos now we want more creatures now we do the exact same thing Scroll this down, because I don't want to put it in a folder accidentally. <laughs> Dra highlight all of that, drag, drop. And I just double click the uh, more creatures, double click the mods, double click the more creatures dot zip. Okay, now we want to highlight all of this. Eh, read me too, why not? <laughs> Drag that to dot minecraft or minecraft yeah dot minecraft duh <laughs> all right okay so everything should be installed we are gonna test her out oh you've got to have minecraft completely closed too by the way this is a good thing if we got that we know it's working <laughs> create new world I'm just gonna put new world just want to make a new world and make sure you're not on peaceful because nothing will spawn. And looky there, we have lots of goodies out. Camels, trees, everything right here at the spawn. <laughs> Wonderful. So I hope this got, I hope this helps you guys and I hope y'all will be using these same mods that I do because I know I definitely enjoy them. And um, ooh, that's loud. Loudness. But uh, thank you guys so much for watching.